in this section we are going to install redux as i already told you redux is a complete independent of react we can separately use redux and we can write the programs so first we are going to understand about redux then only we are going to move forward and when we make a project we are going to combine redux with react so as of now we are just going to learn about redux so that we can understand the concept of action we can understand reduces store how to create store how to create actions how to create reduces everything we are going to understand in redux once we complete the redux we are going to combine all the concepts and we are going to use redux in react so that we can make our complete project now in this first what we are going to do we are going to install redux so for that we need node okay i have already uploaded video on my youtube channel regarding how to install node js if you want you can refer that one or else if you have already installed well and good you can just skip the part once you install node js just open command prompt and check for that okay if it is installed or not you just have to write here node hyphen v you can see my node version is 19.10 maybe in future this version may get changed and also automatically when we install node npm will also be installed node package manager and the version of node package manager is 8.19.3 okay these are the versions i am using maybe in future this might change okay i have already installed node js i will be providing the link in the description so that it will be easy for you to look into that video and install node js in your system okay now once it is done i will close this i have created one redux tutorial folder right click on this and open with code i will open this one you can see i have already opened using visual studio code i will close this inside this i'm just going to create index.js file now here i will write log i will be writing redux tutorial i will save this now inside this itself i am going to open terminal to open terminal the shortcut is control j you can see terminal is opened as i have installed node i can run this js file inside this terminal node index.js i will enter here i will be having the output redux tutorial okay now this is the basic javascript file now i want to run redux inside this so for that what i need i need one package.json file which will be initializing the default settings so to get that one i will be writing npm which will be installed automatically when we install node js npm init hyphen hyphen s i will enter this now you can see this package.json file is created for me you just have to write this npm init hyphen hyphen s package.json file is created inside this i am having the name redux tutorial version is given description if you want you can give main is index.js now all these entries are present inside package for json if you see here i do not have redux package here i do not have redux entry here so now what we are going to do we are going to add redux as a dependency now inside the terminal i am just going to write this one npm install i will be writing redux enter now as soon as it gets installed redux entry will be given inside this package.json once the entry is given you can see here i am having the entry of redux i will just open this one inside this package log.json i am having the redux entry i am having the redux entry entire thing version is displayed table everything is displayed 
what we have done we have just added the dependency of redux in this project so that we can use redux independently and we can understand the concept of redux like actions reducer stores how to create store everything now here again if i just run index.js i will display this one you can see i will be getting the result whatever i have written here that i will be getting this is the basic setup of redux first is you should be having node installed in your system second is we are going to create package.json file third is we are going to add redux dependency okay three steps we have done here once you are set up with this we are ready to get started with redux next session we are going to understand about actions theoretically as well as practically we are going to see so that you can understand completely about actions.